What's up, everybody, and welcome back to our channel. This is Reason 502. I am Ty here with Nick and Ryan. What's so, up? We recently did the warning. I must say, we got a good uh, reaction to our reaction. Yeah. And there's a lot of people yeah. that enjoyed that. And that song, I think I liked it better as it went on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I so. listened to it a couple more times throughout the week. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> good I song. I was enjoying it. And it, was, it was stuck in my head. Perfect starter. For yeah. introduction of yeah. this band. Shout out to Rudy, because he is the random guy that we were all cracking up about, just randomly popping up. So shout out to him. He is the manager. So, yeah. But he, not, so, not so random. Yeah, not so random. Yeah, and he also, all, like, had, he played a part in the song. Which he, yes. like, yeah, so, uh, yeah. yeah, so that was the opener, like we said, uh, for that album. We're going to do the same album today. Uh, we had a lot of requests for this. Two people donated, so we appreciate that. We want to stay anonymous. But this one is called... Dull Knives, Cut Better. Cut Better is parentheses. Mm. But Dull Knives is what it says. This is the ninth song on Queen of the Murder Scene. Yeah, and this is uh, looks like it's going to be a live studio version. Yeah, this uh, I, I read that this was in their basement. So without further ado, let's go ahead and dive on in, baby. This is the warning. Dull Knives, Cut Better. <laughs> better I ain't gonna lie. I, like i said i like the scenery better yeah i think it gives it better quality actual like sound of the music mm -hmm. obviously the energy is better in the other video because it's live right. but the sound is better on this one this one's a little more upbeat yeah mm -hmm. if you ask me yeah she has i think a significantly different voice than the drummer i think it's i think it's a lot different yeah. actually i actually read like in the comments that they said she sings majority of the songs but, you know. Yeah, I think we asked that last time. Yeah, because I wonder if it, if it's yeah. like just her yeah. or all of them. But all of them obviously can all sing. Them, yeah, all so, of them. Yeah, all of them. Yeah, and it might be because they're young, but I just love the energy they bring, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, you can tell that they are extremely passionate about this. Oh yeah, they're um, very detailed too. Their and, stuff, their music is very detailed. Yeah, and I'm so glad that this generation likes this type of music. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it gives me hope. And that is catchy, that first line. I found a dull nice cut better. Oh, yeah. yeah I oh, like everything yeah. about it right oh, now. Oh, yeah. I'm like, oh, yeah. <laughs> This is rocking, man. So they're pointing at you. Oh, yeah. Like, we're coming for you, oh, man. Yeah, baby. That's yeah. what a lot of people were saying, man. This band is the future. Yeah. Man. And I want that drum set. Already off to a good song. <laughs> oh, you yeah. want that? I want that drum set. By the way, a uh, nice Scorpion shirt as well. Oh, yeah. On that singing song. Let's get back to it. Big bass.
Fantastic. Oh man, that was too short. Oh. I need another verse. Give no. me something. Leaves you one more though. Yeah, exactly. Leaves you one more, man. Exactly. Yeah, that was fantastic, man. Yeah, the drummer is just cold. Yeah. yeah. She is just cold. <laughs> I can tell after two songs this band is the real deal. Yeah. You know, this ain't just one fifteen minutes of fame type of thing. You know, got big just because of one video. No, 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 no. These girls can play, man. So, oh yeah. Shout out to and them. And they're super young, so like they're not even in their prime yet. Yeah, not even the prime. The potential goes through the roof. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right, so obviously we knew that this was a concept album. And we skipped uh, a lot of the songs. <laughs> you know, because this is the ninth song. We went from the first to the ninth song. So there's a lot of content that we're missing Yeah. as yeah. far as the meaning. But it seems like to me this is about suicide. Oh, yeah. Or Slowly inflicting the pain. You know, dull knives cut better. Yeah. Plucking the roses, keeping the thorns, so... Yeah, yeah, she says right here. She says, "I hate living a lot live like this. Can't save me now. Yeah. I'm feeling for nothing at all." This is 100%. That's pretty much what people say whenever they're, yeah. you know, she's saying words that people say when they want to commit suicide. Yeah. It's like it's like a like a warning. Yeah, she wants pain basically. She wants pain exactly, yeah. and she doesn't like the life she's in. You know, it's like anybody else would say. So, yeah. I think it may, uh, matches the concept pretty well. And you had a pretty spot on here, my guy. Yeah, and this is like, it says the queen. Like, we don't even know who the queen is because, like I said, we haven't heard the whole album. But uh, the song is about the queen. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Whoever the queen is. Yeah. So give us some more suggestions from them. Oh, yeah. Uh, If you guys always give us a good response, we will keep coming back to them. Uh, And I hope they stay together, and I hope they go a long time. Oh, yeah. Because, like I said, the potential's through the roof. They can go for a long time. I feel like we need this kind of music. Nowadays. That is the end of the video, guys. Tell us what you thought about that song. We love hearing your feedback. Please tell us your views. Thank you for subscribing and hitting that bell. Peace Peace out.